How did Airbus test the A380 structure? Let me explain. The A380 was the first ever double-decker aircraft, and before the aircraft could carry a single passenger, it had to survive extreme structural tests. Airbus engineers built a full-size test airframe and pushed it far beyond normal flight conditions. One of the most critical tests was the wing flex test, where hydraulic jacks bent the wing tips upwards over 24 feet, nearly to their breaking point. This was done to simulate the worst turbulence imaginable. Then came the fuselage pressurization test. The aircraft was sealed, and pressure was increased far beyond normal cabin levels to ensure the skin could handle extreme altitude changes. Engineers also used something called the static test rig, applying over 1.5 million pounds of force to simulate landing, takeoff, and turbulence stress. And they didn't stop there. The A380 underwent fatigue testing that simulated 47,500 flight cycles, nearly two decades of flying, in just a few months. Every inch of the aircraft was covered with sensors tracking how the structure handled wear and tear. 